haven't played. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to start off real slow and I'm just going to play the snare drum. And here's one thing. <clears throat> Don't put your feet on the pedals. And I definitely, sometimes I just can't help myself and I'll probably do it. I'll try and just get into the, into the zone, even though I know you're watching. But like it's just always a f temptation to put my feet on the pedals. <clears throat> so feet on the floor, it just has a weird psychological effect of, you know, when you, if your feet aren't engaged, aren't touching the pedals, it's like your brain's not thinking about it and so all your focus goes into your hands. At least for me, you can figure it out for yourself. But um, I reckon that's it. And I'm going to keep this rolling. And I'm just going to do it. And this is what it looks like. So who knows, I might see you in half an hour. Whatever. I might stop and talk about it. But yeah. But here's what I would do. So you put my feet on the pedal straight away.
tempted to put my feet on the pedals. interesting how um, <clears throat> when I start to fuck up, my feet want to reach for the pedals. Don't know why. Better if you could see it. I'll set it up better next time.
it's what I'm doing here is um, I've been trying to use more of this sort of a technique for the traditional grip um, instead of like this thing which is kind of a bit of a habit for me or I change a lot but anyway that's what I'm doing right now I'm just looking at that and I'm noticing when I'm starting to when that thumb's coming up and when it's losing contact with the knuckle and when these fingers are you know, just looking at...
So you get the idea. And then, like my foot, my right foot, today sucked ass. It's just not happening. Sometimes it's like that with my, with feet if I haven't played for a couple of days. So then today, that's probably what I'll do. It's like you can hear when I'm doing those uh, handed foot uh, singles between the bass drum. Like trying to do them pretty hard and even. It's just not happening. So that's probably what I'll end up doing today. Um, you know, after this, I'll probably sit here for 30 minutes, an hour, see how I feel. I'm feeling pretty good. My hands are just starting to warm up. Um, like at this point, and then, like I was just saying through doing that, I've gone, okay, I want to just pay a bit of attention to my left hand, same with my right actually, and, um, and just try and get my bass drum working today, I don't know why that happens, and who knows, I'll, I'll like have a little break after this and check it all out, and, um, and I'll come back down, it might be fine. <laughs> I think, oh, I think it's, uh, it's the nerves when you're watching. But anyway, I hope that sort of makes sense. Is like, most of what I was doing with my hands was singles and doubles, paradiddles, and then triplets, paradiddle diddles, and, you know, flam taps and and flams um, and then like as, a, as your hands start to feel hot then you can start to move those around the drums and that's a pretty standard warm up um, thing for me like a way to approach it but um, I don't know how long this has been going for but I could sit there and warm up doing that snare drum stuff for easy half an hour um, and then incorporate the feet for the next half an hour and that would be like my first hour and then whatever maybe I'm going to go maybe I'm going to play some tunes or record something or or like just then when I'm like my feet my foot my feet my foot sucks so I'll probably work on that I will and um it's also about the feeling it's like uh, sometimes with, even with hands, it's more of a, it's, a, it's as much as a, of a feeling that if you can tap into the feeling of it, that you seem to be able to do it. And um, same with as I'm playing then, you know, I'll push something and it's like, no, I'm not warm enough to do that or whatever. I start to feel myself tensing. So maybe I'll slow down without stopping, just sort of slow down um, and remind myself of that place again and be trying to actually f be present, you know, not conscious of the video watching me and, and really just like feeling the drumsticks and listening and, you know, all these little details that aren't necessarily like another exercise or another polyrhythm or another thing which is pretty cool if you want to do that yeah I'll just have a bit more of a play <clears throat> so now I'll probably just play stuff and be trying to do things with my foot that's just what happened today it's also a lot easier to do the hand foot stuff with the bass drum uh, without your hi-hat going but um, that's an uh, another little addition for balance.
yeah, lead foot, lead foot today. Anyway, hopefully that's uh, helpful. See what you reckon, let me know. And um, I'm going to do another one on like flow, which actually, to be honest, I, I, wonder, um, I wonder what people mean by it sometimes. Anyway, catch you later.